Hey, TD Superheroes, my name is Alejandro Perez, your sidekick. And in this video, we're going to be creating a simple little window that is able to be docked into your Maya interface. To achieve this, we're going to start off by importing a PySide 2. So we're going to use the PySide module to create the window. And I'm just going to create a shorthand for it, PS2. Then I also want to access Maya's UI. So we're going to import Maya.OpenMayaUI. And we're going to use the shorthand OMUI. We are also going to use Shaboken 2. And we're going to use that to create a wrapper for the open Maya UI that we can actually use. Then we are also going to get access to the Maya Q widget dockable mixin function from the Maya mixin file. This is going to allow us to be able to make our window dockable. Okay, so we're going to start off by getting access to Maya's main window. So that way we can create a window that exists within Maya's main window as a parent. The first thing we need to do is create a variable for the Maya main window pointer. And that is going to be accessing Maya's open UI, the utility, and then we're accessing the main window for Maya. Then here we are going to return the wrapped instance of the pointer and we are going to set it to the PySide2 widget Q widget. Next we are going to create a class called my window. We need to access the Maya QT widget dockable bix in first for our parents for this class and then we actually do the Q dialog from PySide2. So we have to make sure that it happens in this order so that way our dockable window works properly. Now we're going to create our init method and we're going to set it to self, so my window, and then the parent for this window is going to be the Maya main window. Inside of the init method, we are going to be calling the super of the window and initialize it and set it to the parent here. Just so that this window has something, I'm going to create a button for the widget. I find that if you dock something without anything in it, like a window into it, it disappears and it gets hard to access. So we're just going to stick a button in there. It's not actually going to do anything. Then we're going to create a vertical box layout from the pie side to organize our button. And here we will add the button widget to our layout. Now that our little window is set up, let's set up our main method or main function. There we go. And now what we're going to do is call the instance of my window. And we are going to show the window and we're going to set dockable to true. This is now possible because we have imported the dockable mixin file function and we called it here as a parent to the my window class okay so if we run our code we have a window here that is my button and we can stick it there you can see that the tab it exists but the when we called it originally it doesn't have a title so that's why it's kind of like empty like that. So if we wanted to add a title to it, we can. I'm going to do it here right before we create the button. I'm just going to set the window title to my window. 
now you'll see that if we create the window and we dock it, it's going to call my window. We can bring it out. It's called my window. So it makes it easy to distinguish what that is. And we can dock it anywhere inside of Maya's interface that you would be able to dock a window. All right, so that is it for this video. I hope you found it useful. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.